Hello, McAllister Public Information Officer Adrian O'Hanlon here again to show you more about our city government. City codes set the standards for safety, health, and the overall appearance of our community. Enforcing these codes means preventing potential hazards, preserving property values, and fostering pride in our community. So let's take a look at a day in the life of Code Enforcement Officer Tabitha Howell and learn more about city codes. Some of that, but I have so many customer complaints for the south side. I've got to be the main things I look for. Uh, definitely, I work the season, so I, what I'm looking for depends on what season I'm in. Summertime, definitely tall grass. Uh, that keeps me busy and occupied, and accounts for probably. Uh, at least 90% of the violations that I work this time of year. Um, other than that, of course, summertime we've got, uh, you know, if someone needs to clean up and that's something that, you know, can't wait, if the situation is so severe that it can't wait until the fall, then of course I'll address it. Besides growing grass, I will document with uh, time and date stamped photos. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna just kind of see what we can see. Get out of here and he's gonna go put the cap on that sewer for me so we can come back by later and take my little picture and be done with it. We're good to go. Okay, we're next here. Time. This is just the stuff that I proactively identify when I'm out and about, the stuff that I see. All of my letters are inspection based, they're not complaint based. So even if someone files a complaint with me, um, I always follow that up with an actual inspection because sometimes there may not really be an actual violation of city code. Um, but this one, this one's easy. Uh, we can look, there is definitely grass over 12 inches. So we'll go ahead and mark that. The city's codes are on our website and anyone can report an issue through the website or through our citizen engagement app, McAllister Connect, or by calling City Hall. After the city receives a complaint, Code enforcement officers then investigate to determine if there was a violation of city code and then work with the customer to resolve the issue. Now let's hear more about when code enforcement officers exhaust all efforts with someone in violation of city codes. Um, so we've been here a lot. Uh, they are actually still under current notice of violation because the notice is good for six months. Um, so I don't have to reissue that every time. Anyway, the neighbors had called. Uh, I've had numerous neighbors call about this particular property. Um, just different standards of living. And this particular lady, I've worked her enough um, and she knows the standards, she knows the problem. So uh, when I am able to make contact with her, she will get a citation. So. And you told me before, you like to work with people instead of going straight to enforcement. Oh, absolutely. Code enforcement isn't just about following the law, it's about building a safe, clean, and prosperous community for us all. Once again, I'm Adrienne O'Hanlon, and thank you for watching this video as we continue moving McAllister forward.